What's up? I'm about to do a tutorial on the lip roll, which sounds like because I figured, you know what, there aren't enough of out there? Lip roll tutorials. Alright, so let's get started. So I'm going to show you how I learned it, which I don't know, probably is not something that you've heard before, but so you might know this sound that Reeps does. <laughs> All it is is you purse your lips, if you don't know how to do it, purse your lips, mm, and you use your tongue to kind of like push out air like that right out the sun of your mouth. So, right, it's fairly simple. Um, so, um, once you do that, there's an opposite sound to that, which is you pulling your tongue back. And I'm not very good at it, but... It doesn't matter, you don't have to be good at it because this sound isn't the one that sounds cool, it's the lip roll that sounds cool. So it just sounds like Anyway. You get the idea. And you don't have to be good at it, you just have to be able to at least do it and like have the idea of it. And if you can get that down, then doing the lip roll should hopefully be easy because I know a lot of people struggle with it. So the concept is uh, instead of going at the center, you want to uh, pick a side to do it on and go do it out the side. Uh, so the way you might want to do that is start by like frowning if you can or just clenching your mouth, right? And then unclench one side and keep the other side tight. So. This side I do the lip roll on, this side I just keep tight. And so you keep it tight, close your, the rest of your mouth kind of lightly, and then do that sound right out the side. And you know you're doing it right because it'll sound like mine. It has like a different tone to it than that. So if you can get that down, then you are pretty close. That is, I don't know if it's called the outward lip roll, but it's like... I don't know, gives you that like lip roll chain. So it, the outward one is when you push your tongue outward and then the inward one, you just pull your tongue back. And it's not quite that simple, obviously. So something that you should do while you're doing that is lower your jaw during the inward lip roll part and bring it back up during the outward lip roll part. The reason for that is because the lip roll, there's no, you're not sucking in air ever. like. I can inhale and exhale while I'm lip rolling. So what happens is when you lower your jaw, it creates space in your mouth and the air from outside has to rush in. So, um, yeah. So remember, uh, clench one side, frowny, unfrowny, one side. Uh, lower your jaw when you do it and push and Wow, I wish I could talk sometimes. You get what I'm saying. Clench one side, uh, push out, jaw drop and pull back. Push out, jaw drop, it, jaw drop and pull back. And if you can do that, then you get the lip roll chain, which sounds like, which is how you do fanboy alert, which is how you do napalms, uh, can roll like this, like, Anyway, so yeah, I hope that helped, and if you can get the lip roll, you can get all the different variations of it. Just takes practice, so. I'm ass. Anyway, peace.